Hi beauty junkies, it's Rowie Singh here taking over Mecca's YouTube with our very festival holiday makeup tutorial. So I've created this very extra midnight blue, purple, gold look for you guys and I'm going to show you this look pretty much in two levels. I've got level one which is more of an achievable look and then level two right here which is something a little bit more extra. So my loves, if you want to see how I created this look then just keep watching. I'm going to be using my Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation in the color Valencia. So I've got these beautiful, beautiful brushes from Mecca, of course. Um, it's from the Brush Hour collection. And I'm going to be using these today. I've got a nice selection of face brushes and I'm going to be using this little kabuki brush to apply my foundation. I'm very excited to use these, adding a couple of pumps to the kabuki brush and then just sort of buffing that into my skin. Now I only needed a little bit of that foundation and it's already sort of absorbed and melted into my natural skin tone. I'm going to take, of course, NARS again. I've got my Radiant Creamy Concealer. This is in the shade Custard. And I'm just going to pretty much just dot that under my eye. And I'm actually using the Kabuki brush to blend that in. And all you've got to do is just change your application style. See how I'm just dotting it very, very lightly under my eyes instead of sort of buffing it into the rest of my skin. That's going to help you really get that nice sort of blurred effect under your eyes. I'm actually taking that brush and using the excess concealer and dotting that over my eyes and it's going to create a really nice base for when I do my shadows. So I've got a little collection of my absolute favorite products from Mecca's Holiday Collection. Let me just show you this bad boy. So if you haven't seen this before, this is Mecca's Limited Edition Eyes On You Eyeshadow Palette and prepare yourselves, prepare your eyes this this is incredible like I feel like the color selection here is so on point I mean I can talk about this palette forever because it's so pretty but before I get carried away let's jump into the look my first level is going to be a bit more of like a beginner's style color look so let's kick it off with some of these neutral tones first so I'm going to go in with desert first which is this shade right here and I'm just going to Take that for my brush, wow, very pigmented, and just tap off some of that extra color. And I'm using Mecca's blending brush just to kick off that initial bit of color. Essentially just buffing that in to my crease like that, going back and forth, really working that in. And you can already start to see that definition form, which is so, so exciting. I'm very, very excited about this palette. See how I'm using these little circular motions here that really helps to blend the color into your skin and make it a little bit more seamless. So we've got our base sorted. It's a nice chocolatey brown and you wouldn't think this would go, but I'm actually gonna mix that in with this Violet Femme right here. So using the same brush actually, I'm just gonna tap into that purple just like that, tapping off that extra product and I'm just going to literally, oh my God, sorry, I'm just, I got distracted by how good this color is. I'm just fluffing it on my lid, like tapping it ever so lightly and then running it back and forth. So gals and guys at home, my beauty junkies, if you're watching this right now and you're normally afraid to use color, fear not, fear not, because this palette really, really makes it that much easier. First of all, the product fallout is nil, like I'm not really getting anything anywhere and I'm actually being quite liberal with the color as well. And the second thing is, is that like this is very easy to build. Like you can take this from level one to level 100 very, very easily. And all you have to do is just work at the color and focus on building and intensifying. So I'm using Mecca's eyeshadow brush now. We're gonna pack, 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 pack that color on. And by that I mean I'm just tapping into my skin, as you can see, very gently. And what this does is that it really helps lock that color in place. It's not going to move and it's also not going to spread and blend. Please don't judge me for my messy products. It just means that I've been using them a lot, but I'm using my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara just to polish off this look. I'm using Bare Minerals blush in the color Strike a Pose. I'm going to take my blush brush from Mecca, dipping in and I'm just going to fluff that on my cheeks. So I'm rosing up those cheeks quite nicely actually. So I'm digging into my other favorites here. I've got this beautiful highlighting palette from Stilla. It is the Shine Bright Heaven's Dew palette. I'm gonna tap into the first shade and the second shade, just combining those two. And I'm gonna add those to my cheeks. 
Using my Precision Eye Brush from Mecca, I'm adding that highlighter to my inner corner. Because this is my secret hack to making your eyes look bigger, you guys. Can we take a moment for this packaging right here? Oh my goodness, if I could wear this packaging, I would too. Ciate London, a glitter flip in the shade Candy. And I'm gonna add that to my lips. Oh, how cute. This is my wearable look. Let me know what you guys think. I'm loving it because it is colorful and there are pops to it, but it is still something that you can wear during the day and get away with. For this time, we're gonna go next level bold. I'm of course gonna be using the color Baby Blues, which is this beautiful popping blue shade. And we're gonna take that precision brush from Mecca and just make sure you're tapping off that extra color because you don't want too much fallout. So we're gonna take that and we're gonna add it to the inner corner and essentially applying it on top of the purple. And what that's gonna do is create a really nice navy. So I'm gonna go back in with Violet Femme and I'm just going to swipe that on the mid section of my eye and then just blend the crease out with the blue, just like that. And that's really gonna elevate this look just that little bit more. Don't forget to soften those edges with your blending brush using those circular motions, of course. And what we've created now is this very smoky midnight sky eye. Girl, it is not a rowy look without a little bit of gold. So I'm gonna take Citron, which is this beautiful color here. This gold is very, very delicious and creamy and I can't wait to just tap it under my eye like this. And of course, if you apply too much, fret no more, my queens, because you can blend that out quite easily. And I'm also gonna take a little bit and pop that on my brow bone. The thing with me is that a look is never complete without my Mecca Cosmetica Enlightened Powder Highlighter. And I'm taking my highlighter brush, dipping into that once more. And that's gonna elevate my highlighter as well. Like, I wanna be able to shine. My ultimate goal is to blind my friends and family with my highlight. <laughs> and because this look is all about taking it to the next level, I'm gonna pop on some lashes as well. So my lashes are on. To polish off this look into tight all together, very inspired by the packaging of the Northern Lights Eye and Cheek Palette of the Holiday Collection, which means I wanna add a bit of sparkle to my face. So I've got these cute little gems that I wanna add. And I've added these right under my eyes for a little bit of sparkle. I'm really feeling this look. I'm loving the midnight blue and purple eyes mixed with the gold. And I have the beautiful holiday collection to thank, especially the Eyes On You palette because it really did elevate my look that much more. Thank you so much, beauty junkies, for tuning in and watching my tutorial. I'm going to leave you with one tip for the holiday season. My tip for staying cute this Christmas is to one, treat yourself and buy yourself a present because you deserve it. And secondly, just shower yourself in so so much color and beautiful highlighter. I hope you were inspired and I would love to see your creations of this look. So don't forget to tag me and of course Mecca Maxima. It's been an absolute pleasure taking over the Mecca Beauty Junkie channel. Hope to see you guys again soon. Bye.